believed to date back to the 12th century, some 900 years ago, is this monumental barn conversion that is said to have once been part of the Tintin Abbey estate. The barn was built for the Cistercian monks who lived in the area up until the mid 16th century, until King Henry VIII's English Reformation, which saw the Tintin Abbey surrendered and beginning its 500 year decline into the majestic ruin we see today. A unique feature about this property is that it was designed in the shape of a cross, a significant reminder to this property's fascinating history. Renovated around 20 years ago, today this barn offers over 6,000 square feet of accommodation, making it an impressive family residence, which perfectly blends existing period detail with sympathetic contemporary touches. There are dramatic vaulted ceilings, which greet you as you pass through the galleried entrance hall, with the property boasting five double bedrooms, including a spectacular primary suite, as well as several spacious reception areas, including a home cinema. Sat in around 1.6 acres of well-maintained grounds, the property is located within a small exclusive development of barns known as Rogerstone Grange, and is located on the fringes of the village of St. Arvind. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Monk's Barn. This most magnificent galleried entrance hall with flagstone flooring and soaring vaulting ceilings that act as a backdrop for the beautiful exposed beams. The ground floor accommodation firstly offers an expansive open plan kitchen dining living area with a central island with quartz working surfaces. There is a separate utility area with bifolding doors leading out onto the gardens. There is then a drawing room which is overlooked by a minstrel's gallery which could also make an ideal dining room, study or space to relax with views to be enjoyed over the gardens. There is then a most impressive 34 foot lounge, a great space for relaxing or for entertaining friends and family. You then have your own private cinema room with reclining seats and bar. This ash staircase leads up to this expansive galleried landing. There are large windows to all elevations, flooding this area with light. A notable design feature of this landing is this minstrel's gallery that looks down onto the drawing room. This area is currently used as a home office and has French doors leading out onto a balcony which enjoys beautiful views over the gardens and of surrounding countryside. Each one of the bedrooms includes exposed wooden beams and high vaulted ceilings. Four of the bedrooms offer space for a double bed, one of which boasting an ensuite, plus there are two family bathrooms. You then have this incredible primary suite enjoying a dual aspect as well as the benefit of a separate dressing room with a range of bespoke wardrobes as well as an island with a marble work surface. Outside the property is accessed via gated entrance leading you onto the driveway with ample parking from multiple vehicles as well as access to the triple garage. The barn sits most comfortably in its 1.6 acres of ground with flagstone patio areas, deck seating areas, and as well as a well-maintained level lawn to the rear, enjoying a private south aspect. The grounds are surrounded by an array of shrubs, bushes, and trees, giving you privacy, with the property being surrounded by beautiful countryside. Monk's Barn just has to be one of the biggest barn conversions I've ever seen. There are gentle nods to the history of this property throughout, and it's perfect for an expanding family. So if you think, this could be your next property. Want to get in touch with a range of viewing with one of the team.